you know, I, 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 I want to let us to understand this. Listen, your success intimidates a lot of people. Your sources, when I mean your sources, I mean it. Your sources intimidate a lot of people. It, your sources. So that is why you need to wait to the end of this video and see the reason why people are being intimidated and see the purpose why they envy you and also see some certain things that I will do. It. I will let you to know, particularly in this video. The truth is this. Many people envy your sources. <laughs> Many people envy your sources because uh, the, according to the video I posted yesterday, sources cost what problem. So one reason why people envy your sources, envy your doing because they never believe that you can do it. That is one of the greatest reasons why people who are around you, people whom you do used to do stuff with, you know, do stuff, you know, uh, it may be right from your childhood, you all are friends. Uh, maybe you do used to do things, do stuff. In, suddenly, they start to see another system of life. They start to see that you are doing more well, more better than all of them. Or they start to see if, that you are progressing more than them. Then many of them will suddenly turn against you instead of learning from you. Yes, that is one of the greatest reasons why people will do it. We suddenly turn against you because they never believe in you. Yes, they can see you as someone whom they're company. They, uh, the same company together. Maybe they think before you are best of the same feather. And at the end, you come to liberate yourself. Maybe they see you as someone who can never grow more than them. And suddenly, they come to realize that you are not only growing more than them. You are expanding, elevating succeeding catapulting more than them that is when they will suddenly turn against you so another reason why people will do what we envy you why people will be intimidated by your doing is because all their wishes is that you you are what you are a failure they never wished to they never wished anything they never expect that you will do what you will succeed all their thought is that you are not going to succeed no matter how hard you may work no matter what what you may try to put in in hand no matter anything you do you will never succeed <laughs> you can say you know there are some people who will look at you and say you will never succeed look at the brothers of david they gather all the whole men they took everybody out the, it was only david that was recorded that was left at home to take care of sheep you know, they look at him as a black sheep. That means someone whom they can't take out. Someone whom they look down. Someone who they never believe that he can do it. He can battle or he can become something. Because the truth is, in those early days, they don't have anything like uh, trading, business, marketing, uh, finance, YouTube, ETC, any kind. They don't have it. The only way in which you can prove yourself that you are a man is when you are able and capable to do it to confront a war when you are capable to face a battle face to face and you come back and give them the result and what maybe your master or maybe the the, the overall give chairman or give the king that this is what you do this is how you battle this is where you 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 position this is your position this is how you, how you attack the enemy with that, they will give you rank. And they look at David, they can't David as no, as a black sheep, as no, someone who don't have that ability to do such things. So, the, many people will do it, we can't you out. They will never believe that one day you will succeed. They will just call you as a failure. But the moment you prove them wrong, that is when they will start to do it. To be in, that's when they will start to do it, feel intimidated. That's when they will start to have that urge that you totally intimidate them. <laughs> you got to say, so many people are intimidated by your doing. Many people are intimidated by your what? By your personal improvement. <laughs> Believe me, then think about it. Maybe one day like this, you just come out. Uh, uh, maybe someone believe within them uh, that nothing good will come out from you. Uh, <laughs> you know, that was when I was in Nigeria. So there was one particular teacher that insulted one of my friends. We were all the same in class. So everybody we are just, you know, some people were, the teacher was just asking us a question. He said, 
what do you want to be in time to come like you know even these days they do use to repeat it what do you want to be or who who, who who do you like to become or what do you want to be in future to come so some people said I, I, I want to be a doctor some say I want to be a lawyer some want to say I want to be this me, mostly me the only thing that I have in mind is that I want to be a banker or a doctor so it comes to a point where one of my friends were so intimidated the teacher intimidated him because the guy was like me well we were too you know we were too dull in, in class so he comes to a point he said uh, uh, you are you are you 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 say you are going to be this you who don't come to school you don't do this you how can you do it how can you how can you make it when you don't come to school you are not you are you are you don't come to school you are always late you don't read your book you don't do this <laughs> but surprisingly, <laughs> the guy that I'm telling you now, <laughs> only God knows how to define his own weight. So what am I trying to say is this. There are some people who will automatically, would automatically conclude you because of the foundation they see. And the moment you prove them wrong, that's when they will be what intimidated. They will start to feel what ashamed they'll start to feel as if you intimidate them you you insult them by proving them wrong that you can do it that is when you realize that your success intimidates a lot of people yes even some parents believe me or not there are some parents that we do that will just come out boldly and tell the, some of their children you maybe you made a mistake or maybe there's something you they make with anger they will vomit that that pain that is particularly in their heart and tell you ah you i know you i know you can't be successful i know you can't make it i know you can't do this i know you can never make me proud one day i know that you are you are going to be a disappointment to my generation <laughs> you understand me some parents can do this say it politely you know what I'm saying? <laughs> they will just tell you politely without thinking twice. But you, you're going to realize that the moment you prove them wrong, many of them will, just, will be ashamed to come close to you. Not that they don't like what they are saying, but your sources, your sources will always make them to recall and remember, even if you yourself don't think of it, even you yourself don't remember all those things, all those stuff, they will do what? They will still have that mind that word will still be coming to them it will make them feel what intimidated or ashamed you know there is one of my friends uh, that tell me a story even my mom my dad still give me the same story so he said there was a, a, a boy an orphan so this orphan was in the farm with his uncle they were just working in a, a farm farming you know those days doing farm work suddenly the boy see what Aeroplane, aeroplane that was just you know flying. He said to his uncle that in time to come, he will surely buy aeroplane like this. He will be the first to buy aeroplane in their village. The uncle said, "You who don't have, you know, he started to insult the boy because he's an orphan. He, he, he used class to pursue the boy, you know, beat him with class and pursued him. And the boy have already grown up. He decided to run away. <laughs> they said when the boy was coming." To visit his uncle, he dropped the early quarter, a place close to the to the village, and he come with a mighty word cast. A mighty cast. And he said to his uncle, the reason why I decide to visit you, because those days you insulted me and you didn't believe in me. And that's why I automatically come to do it to show you what I have achieved. So that is just it. 